Okay, so this is my first build video. This is my Apex build. It's a five inch Mr. Steel version. Uh, obviously without his electronics and I'll be running this on better flight. Uh, grand plans for this little guy. It'll be running on 6S. These moon boot motors, which are 2407, 2200 KVs. So they should be pretty torquey and make things happen in a hurry. Uh, got a T-motor stack, 55 amp, here ready to go in. Uh, I've had a history of putting these things in the water, so I am conformal coating everything. And uh, that's ready to go in. In the back, the VTX is a uh, TBS Unified Pro 5G. Uh, it's good for 800 milliwatts. The uh, instructions Mr. Steel version says to mount this bracket up here and to extend it through. I could not get it happen right, so uh, I'm just going to risk it here. It's probably going to be a little bit risky in an accident, but uh, we'll see how it comes together and whether I can strengthen it. Uh, so the ESC, 55 amp ESC, is ready now to go on. Uh, I've done all the motor wires to the LEDs. They're just taped in place at the moment. And I'll conformal coat of these connections and uh, I'll also coat those as well. Up front, this uh, Foxier camera here. Get a bit of a close up shot there. And uh, that's a Falcor 3 Mini. Um, weighs a bomb, it's heavy to, to, to the feel. So that's where we're at at the moment. Um, I will finish getting this ESC wired up and. Uh, We'll get the flight controller in place. Speaking of the flight controller, this is the second time I've used one of these. And I uh, didn't make any notes the first time around. But it has, there we go, that on pit. Uh, the instructions are really difficult to understand when you bridge those two connections. I know last time that I built it, I interpreted it wrong and I couldn't work it through better flight with the pit switch. Or pit setting so uh, I'm going to just put it to the left position the on and I'll wire up the VTX and test it before I put it together and hopefully I don't have to to reverse that decision um, again I don't have a full understanding of how that works but when I did set it up in better flight the way I thought it was intended to work it didn't so uh, and I just couldn't get anything from the VTX last time when I changed that that bridge over to the on position, everything came good, I think. But I might have it all asked backwards and I'll find out soon enough. But uh, look, great VTX, uh, sorry, great flight controller. Totally digging that on the camera and the VTX. You've got the choice there of five volt or, or battery voltage. That's just awesome. Um, yeah, it's a good looking flight controller. Shame, no USB-C, but anyway, can't have everything in life, I guess. So, uh, that's the uh, the first little update. A few more hours work, might start to look like something, and um, can't wait to fly it. I think this thing's going to go like, like stink. Okay, cheers, guys.